Some people are more into uh, the creative things, so they will be very good at bringing ideas, concepts, promoting, going out, networking, and will be really bad at producing, keeping track on the time frame, on their timeline, and really bad at financials. Some people, it will be the other way around. And the question is, which areas of responsibilities am I burning for and would like to handle myself? And on the other way around, which areas of uh, responsibilities am I already hating? And I have to figure out how I'm gonna deal with that. Because once again, the point is to get ready to uh, enjoy what you're gonna do, because no matter what, it's hard work. I'm from the USA. I've been here in Denmark for about eight months. And um, there was a group of five of us from our Danish class that said, okay, we, we are all uh, spouses of people working here. We all had college educations. We all had worked all our lives. And all five of us were not working at all right now. So it was like, okay, surely between the all of us, we can find something. We can do a business that we can, we can work on. It's a, a group of very smart people uh, who are used to working hard and used to making money who suddenly find themselves w without a way to make money, without a way to work hard. It's a question of what specific do we settle on to actually put our energies into. It is very important also here today to realize uh, how you picture yourself. What are your ambitions? Actually, it helped give some real specific ideas of what we need to be thinking about in order to make a business work. Uh, our, our leader was very specific about, here are the ideas you need to be thinking about. You need to be thinking about exactly what your product is. Is there a market for it? Is there a reason people are going to want to buy it? And what concrete steps are you going to need to take to get there? So a very specific set of things that you need to be thinking about in order to say, yes, I've, I've got a business idea that, that might work.